To some other news, two American scientists and a Japanese researcher have won the 2008 Nobel Prize for Chemistry for the discovery of a glowing protein in jellyfish. The breakthrough has helped scientists spot the onset of illnesses such as cancer and Alzheimer's disease. Li Yong has more details. The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences announced the winners of the 2008 Nobel Chemistry Prize Wednesday in Stockholm. The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has decided to award the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for the year 2008 jointly to Professor Martin Schalfi, Columbia University in New York, Professor Osamu Simomura, Woods Hole Institute of Oceanography at Woods Hole, and Professor Roger Chan, University of California, San Diego. And the Academy citation runs for the discovery and development of the green fluorescent protein GFP. The glowing green fluorescent protein GFP was first observed in a species of jellyfish in 1962. Since then, the protein has become one of the most important tools used in contemporary bioscience. With the aid of GFP, researchers have developed ways to watch processes that were previously invisible. The strong green color of the jellyfish protein appears under blue and ultraviolet light, allowing researchers to illuminate cancerous tumors, show the development of Alzheimer's disease in the brain, or the growth of harmful bacteria. One of the winners, Dr. Martin Chalfi, reacted with surprise after learning about the award. He explained why he became involved in the GFP research project. But we are really clueless as to how mechanical force gets sensed by cells. And this means we don't know the molecules that underlie hearing or balance or stretch of our muscles or our detection of blood pressure or our sense of touch. So I work on the genetics of the sense of touch. In my work, in many aspects of it, we use GFP as a tool. So I'm more, uh, not only a developer, but an end user of, of GFP. Now a Nobel laureate, Dr. Chalfi says he'd like to use his newfound fame to try and get more government support for science and research. Leo, CCTV. And that's it for this news update on CCTV International. I'm Bixing. Thank you for watching.